we know that going back about eight years or so, PCs were becoming more, com it was really more of a commoditized market. And what we see now is that users and uh, especially even in the B2B community are wanting more innovation, especially at the high end, of, high end of the range. So we've seen this trend towards innovation and high end technology, even at a desktop PC. And so what we've developed here uh, is we've created a new 9,000 class of the Latitude commercial business line. And this 9510 uh, notebook here is our first most innovative, highest end notebook that we've released. It's a 15 inch notebook that starts at only 3.2 pounds. And it's our first offering with AI and machine learning uh, to help customers become, or help users become uh, more efficient in their workday. And one of the, and, you know, just kind of at a high level, the way this AI machine learning works is that it recognizes the way that you work in a number of different areas, including battery management, application development, um, and even just kind of in the way in the way that you toggle between different applications and use cases. So um, it's you know, and it's also our first offering that have have both within the same model a two-in-one offering as well as a note standard notebook offering. And for you know, for business users, that actually makes it really easy. It's one image, one uh, type of model to deploy, and you can actually uh, you don't have to go between different types of models or notebooks to serve your users who need both two-in-ones and notebooks. So just uh, practically speaking with that AI feature, I'm thinking Windows has that ability where I can set my battery settings for performance, and so this would be automated, essentially. Yeah, that's right. It's what we've done is we've built a lot of, uh, built technology on top of that. And what's going to allow you to do is, or actually what it will do is recognize some of the ways that you work. So as you go through your standard work day, it'll know, okay, at this point in, at this point in time, it knows that, you know, if you're using this, this type, these types of applications, it'll know how to manage your battery. It knows that you typically plug in at night. It knows that, you know, it, during this por portion of your day, you typically have heavy usage. So it tries to apply key learnings as you go through your day and how you manage your battery and what kind of applications you're using. And that could also, could that assist IT with maintenance and updates and, and management? Oh, for sure. Um, and that's another another part of that we're using with uh, part of our pro support offering is trying to recognize when problems are going to occur before they occur. So it's actually knowing what's happening in your system and recognizing potential issues before that, which really helps uh, centralize IT managed systems that are deployed in the field. And can you give us just a quick rundown, a tour of the product, some of the, uh, the standout specs? Sure, you bet. Um, so this is a 15.0 inch screen um, and it's it's a high-end IPS type screen uh, that has both uh, touch and non-touch availability. Um, one of the really interesting features we have here is top firing speakers. So what we're going to offer is a speaker phone type experience within a PC. So we basically took the insides of a typical kind of Jabra type system, put it in the notebook, and we also have, as I've mentioned before, this kind of AI type uh, application within the speaker experience. So it'll know you can toggle between if you know you're in a loud environment, kind of like where we are today, or if you're in a soft kind of quiet room, or if you're in a conference call situation, it will recognize where you are and actually uh, manage the, both the microphone and the speaker experience within that. So that's a really, and so these top firing speaker here produce the, by far the highest quality speaker experience that we've, that we've offered. And this is also, I think, one of the first laptops to support 5G. That's right. We will have, we, it is 5G ready, and so we'll be offering 5G when the carriers are ready, probably around this time, probably around the summertime. It depends on the region. It depends on when carrier availabilities are, but it's definitely meant for, definitely um, built for 5G support. One of the interesting things we did is we put all of our antennas, including 5G antennas, here in the base rather than the top. And what that allows you to do is keep these bezels super thin. Um, and so your 5G antenna will actually be kind of around that little speaker, which again, gives you better throughput and allows for a better design of the system.